Hello everyone, welcome to a new video. Yep, this is pen light. Why am I always saying this is pen light? Cause you guys know it's pen light. But anyway, I'm here to play again because I actually don't have nothing better to do and I make actually a lot of DLC mods. I think you guys saw that, but for a good reason. Anyway, um, and also, I saw that we kind of, you know, a bit close to reach 2,000 subscribers on this channel. If you guys subscribe to my channel, it will really, it will make my day. Okay, now I'm not going to be like those type of person who beg to subscribe. Just subscribe whatever you feel like it. You know, just do what you want. Yeah. Anyway, so let's um, continue this because I'm actually kind of interested interested to see how this will go. Okay, the last time, uh, I think we, yeah, I think we were here. Uh, I don't much remember what happened. I don't know why I'm having like a brain fart right here, but um, I believe we're going to test. I, I, don't, I don't know. I really did forget. So let's just watch this. And uh, yeah, before you know it, we've joined up with Sayur again and are on our way to Natsumi's. Man, what a week, huh? It is certainly not how I imagined it going, I must admit. Don't worry, it's a bit awkward for everyone. After all, it's not like any of us have done public performance before. But it's just friends and family tonight. Once we get going, it'll be fun for everybody, you'll see. Yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing what all this fuss is about. Yeah, looking forward to laughing at us making others of ourselves. That too. Oh yeah, there. We take this awkward atmosphere with us as we all step inside the house. Yeah, not so house. Welcome, welcome, come in. Oh god, is that is our? It's not Sami's mother is going to see me is like hypnotizing three girls like that. I mean, I think she, yeah, I think she knows that this is for like a festival time, but uh, they don't know that not to me likes do it, likes me hypnotizing her, so that's gonna be something. Well, yeah, this is me mod is here to get rid of it or make it more awkward. I'm not sure. Hi, Atsuko. Here you go. Natsumi told me how well you did this weekend. Sh she did, huh? I'm so proud of you, huh? huh? Really wish I was there to see it myself. Yeah, <laughs> thanks. Okay, now you you are always being nice to you uh, to not so smaller, but not me. Okay, Kyo. What is wrong with you? Okay, I'll stop complaining. And gosh, Sayori. Uh, yes. You've grown. I how do you think it has been that long since we last saw each other, Mr. Akemi? I mean, how to go? Hmm. Well, in any case, uh, it's lovely to see you again, dear. Likewise. Gotta admit, I'm feeling a little awkward myself as I watch these wo women talk amongst themselves. Among us? <laughs> they all seem really close, and I'm just. And it's nice to see you again, Kiyo. Uh, uh huh. I'm just standing here like I don't belong. Is he alright? Uh, he's always like this. <laughs> Yeah, I'm fine, that's okay. Nice to see you too. You know, I'm just going to say it. Say what? You remind me of our... Ishiro. Mom! Oh my god, you didn't. Maybe they can go back to ignoring me. This isn't good at all. Ishiro? How's he doing? How the, how's he doing any, anyhow? I can feel my chest. Tired, but... I can't afford to climb up now. I've got a show to do. Oh, he's fine. Hold up hit in his room doing who knows what. Well, it won't kill him to come down and say hello. I've gotta get my head to the uh, in the game and fast. Oh, leave him alone. You know how shy he gets. Besides, do you really want him watching this thing we're doing? Uh, no, I guess not. So, speaking of which, shall we get to it then? Oh, let's. Before I need to get dinner started. Alright. Short time at last. Me, Natsumi, and Hiroko have these all figured out in the classroom. So I just need to remember to s to stay on script for the most part. 
Sorry guys if you're hearing like music from my headphones because I think the music is kind of loud But yeah Okay, mom, so like I said on the phone, this is supposed to be a dry run of what we're going to do for the culture fest. We'll be stressing for volunteers before the show and asking them to do a little test with us just to see if they'll be a good fit. And here goes going to do that test with you now, okay? Alright, so what happens now, Hiroko? The rest of us watch uh, as Hiroko robs the back of her head and lets out a nervous chuckle. Uh, yeah, okay. We argued during the planning that she'd be the one to do this as a newcomer in our group. So, like, put your hands out in front and hold them together like this. Okay. Yeah, like that. Now you gotta hold them in front of your face and put your pointer finger out like I'm doing, okay? Like this. You got it. Now watch this space between your fingers and imagine there's like an elastic band wrapped around those fingers. Okay, so that elastic band is getting tighter and tighter, so it's pulling those fingers towards each other. It's so weird to see that uh, Hiroko is just like being nice, I just, I'm just, I'm, I don't know, I'm just not very used to this. Uh, yeah. As she explains, Hiroko makes a circle motion with her finger around Atsuko's hand, which is something else we taught her. Oh, getting tighter and tighter, and pulling those fingers closer and closer until they touch. Atsuko laughs while the rest of us look on in amazement. Seems everything is going to plan so far. Uh, awesome! That right there totally proves you can be hypnotized. So, um. You still want to be a part of our show? Why yes, oh, I would, young lady. <laughs> a gentle laugh. Laughter fills the room as the woman expressed their delight at this little pre-show performance. I have a question. What, except one woman. What's that? What would have happened had our volunteer not gone along with your little trick? Huh? Is it said this proves Atsuko can be hypnotized? So, had it not worked up, said it is true? I heard Natsumi clear her throat before offering the explanation. Well, not exactly. You can hypnotize most people, but whether you can at any moment depends a lot on their desire and level of comfort, among other things. Yeah, doing this right off the bat is a good way of est establishing that before you invite them on stage. I see, it just strikes me that Atsuko passing your test was not a foregone conclusion. Yeah, so, did you have a plan B? We, we didn't. Uh, anyway, no time to waste on win the show. Yeah, it's time to get hypnotized, it's not totally illegal to do that. God damn it. We then took ourselves to the living room. I never. S oh damn! Okay, this is this is weird. Weird. Why am I so tall? They, this is like looking at me, <laughs> like uh, I'm s I'm some tall person. Sorry about that. I mean, to be fair, I mean I'm not a tall person in in real life. I'll be honest with you. I'm just very short. Like as a man, five foot seven is short. So uh, yeah, make fun of of me, whatever you guys want. Okay, but I don't give a crap. Alright, pretty sure you guys won't even make fun of me, but still. Some of the haters will. But hey, if the haters are watching this uh, video, thank you. Thank you for the views and thank you for the money. <laughs> anyway, let's continue. Let's meet Hiroko and Atsuko. As my lineup of, of volunteers got themselves sit on one of the couches while Sayori, as our audience, critic took the other. And then there's me. The host and a hypnotist standing behind the participants are ready to get the show on the road. As soon as Sayori stops staring at me like that, as if she's as if she's talking, yeah, just taking Marco. It's not that hard. Just taking word. It's it's not that hard, okay? Jesus, detailed notes in her head and getting ready to grade me at the end. 
no, come on, I'll be, it'll be okay, deep breath. Yes, it'll be okay, let me just take a screenshot of this, and also for the thumbnails. Because I need something with the thumbnail to prove this I'm not clay betting. Okay, thanks for coming everyone, I hope, pause, I hope you are ready to see more hypnosis in action. Let's just pretend I became widely excited for a moment there. My god, how many... Okay, how many freaking... I keep clicking on the exit button, I don't know why. How how many do I have to take a screenshot of this? <laughs> See, that's how you YouTubers suffer sometimes. You know, you have to find a way to, uh, you know, make a better thumbnail for your videos. <sighs> I'm talking a lot. Let's just pretend that I become already excited for a moment there. Sure, we should we could found a more forgiving test audience than this woman. I bet even that Ishiro kid would have been better. Now I don't know if any of you have seen a hypnosis show before. Maybe some of you saw something like this a year ago, but what I'm about to do is okay then. With the help of tonight's brave volunteers. Stop touching my head, dick. Uh, I'm going to show you all how much fun hypnosis can be. <laughs> Bruh. Alright, so now I walk around to the front of my volunteers. As I pull my pen light out of my pocket and hold it above the- Jesus Christ, why did I just realize she has big buzz? No, can I get you guys to focus on the light in my hand? My hair pounding, I watch as the three of them turn their gazes upward to the pen light in my hand as I switch it on. Switch it on. Good. Now, I want you all to take a deep breath and focus this well like as the light cuts your eyes. Try not to think too much about everyone's attention on me. I do my best to stare the light over on each person in turn while speaking as calmly and clearly as I can. And while you're watching the light, no notice how natural it becomes to focus to focus on the light that catches your eye and to focus on the sound of my voice. So as you focus more and more as you take a deep breath in and out, you'll find that any other noises serve only to make you more focused. More and more focus on the light, more and more focus on my voice as you breath once more in and as you <laughs> sorry the faces they are doing and as you breath out now I want you to let your eyes close and allow yourself to be become even more focused, even more focused as your eyes close and that's right. Eyes closed, allowing yourself to be become a completely focused on my voice. Popping my pen light back into my pocket, I love myself a breath of my own. So far, so good. Everyone's cooperating is fine so far. And now that you also completely focus on my voice, I'd like you all to tense your entire bodies from the muscles in your cheeks all the way down to your toes. Just tense all over and and in the moment when I count down from 3 to 1, I'm going to ask you to release all that tension. When I count down from three when i reach the number one you are allow yourself to become uh, as relaxed as you can possibly be all this right now but about to become completely entirely relaxed not a drop of tension in your body as i count now three two and one i snap my fingers on the count of one just for added effect and almost instantly had to begin to drop that's right, not a drop of tension, completely relaxed and focused, letting you every muscle become loose and limp. Can you saw your until a muted gasp? He had me as the Hiroko even slumps into a Atsuku's shoulder. She's surely never seen her friends like this before. That's right, allowing yourself to enjoy this deeply relaxed feeling you're experiencing. So now, from this point on until the end of the show, whenever I and I, and only I, touch you on the top of your head and say the word sleep. 
you will immediately and automatically return to this wonderfully deep state of relaxation and focus that you're feeling now. In fact, you may allow yourself to become even more relaxed and even more deeply focused every time I touch the top of your head and say the word sleep. Okay, that's about us. <sighs> True as I can be with them, given I'm supposed to be on the clock here. I need to move quickly on to the show part of this performance. So with that in mind, let's just, let's test that response in front of everyone. On a count of three, I'd like you all to awaken, okay? C counting up, one, two, and three, awake. I light further open and limbs steer back into motion as my three subjects begin to rarely ride themselves on the couch. And while they're sitting back into their seats, I turn around to face my audience. So, now, now you've all seen a little of what hypnosis can do, but I know what some of you must be thinking. The hush should have come to his fair first before stepping out in front of all these people. Oh, well, I didn't want to say anything, but if we're bringing it up... Like, seriously, the dude's a mess. You must be thinking there's no way they're hypnotized, this is all fake. If it helps, I am now thinking our resident hypnotist needs to read the room better. Doc's sake, okay, cues, chill out. Take a deep breath, until you attend it back to your volunteers and stay on script, it'll be fine. So let's give you doctors something to think about while our volunteers sleep, sleep, and sleep. Again, as I speak, to, I reach out and touch each woman in turn and they drop straight back down into a trance. Sorry about that guys, my dad was here. But anyway, let's continue. It's funny, but even with that little commotion, I didn't even doubt for a moment that they were responses how I wanted. All the way back down, that's right. And then I think one of my next words while I feel Sayuri's eyes firmly on me. Despite her snarkiness, it feels to me like she's genuinely interested in what I'm about to do next, as I rest my fingers gently on the top of Natsumi's head. Now, the person I'm touching, I'm going to suggest something to you that's going to feel com completely true. As for what I'm doing now, we are doing our planning session, not to me, and he could agree to a list of things I could use a suggestion during the show. So long as I stick to the to the list and remain careful in my phrasing, then neither of them can complain about what I'm going to do. The next time you're wide awake and for the reminder of the show, you'll be absolutely convinced that laughter is better in this house. Sorry guys, you're still listen to something in the background I'm, I'm really sorry but I can't do anything about it <laughs> and I'm proof that it, it's possible to use my pen light in a very fun and safe way once and for all any laughter you hear will make you incredibly angry and you will demand that whoever's laughing most stop immediately but no matter how angry you get when people laugh you will never resort to violence or say anything you think you regret do you understand? Yeah. Good. Now. Hi, I'm back. So, um, <laughs> yeah. So the whole thing happened in the background was my my dad and my brother. But uh, yeah, I couldn't keep recording because you know it was also kind of late. So uh, this is actually I'm recording now. I'm continuing this episode actually on the next week so yeah sorry about that but i'm here back so let's continue i next place my hand gently to rest on her mother's hand the person i'm touching now the next time you'll you're wide awake and for the reminder of the show you are going to find the word hypnosis is the funniest thing whenever you hear the word hypnosis you are going to laugh historically because it's the funniest thing you have ever heard in your life <laughs> god damn it Sayuri. you can stop and catch your breath if you have to 
But nevertheless, hypnosis is the funniest word to you and it makes you laugh. Do you understand? I understand. Wonderful. And now, I save Hiroko for last because, well, I'm playing mom and daughter against each other. I have something different in mind for her. The person I am touching, the next time you're wide right awake and for the reminder of the show, you will feel a strong and natural impulse to steal people's socks. It was two on our list. That's why I hesitated. But I'm just I'm dating to the venue here. Venue, venue. I, I, I'm very sorry I pronounced that wrong. <laughs> when you're awake, and for the reminder of the show, you'll take it and imitate liking to the sock of all the volunteers here tonight. You'll take so much of a liking that you'll feel an incredible urge to steal the socks for your private collection. Huh. <laughs> so whenever you feel no one's paying attention to you, you'll use the chance to steal a stock from one of our volunteers. Whoever you are stealing from won't resist. You'll simply steal the socks for your collection while no one is watching because, after all, you are also a master of sneaking. Do you understand? Y yeah. Great. And just to make myself clear to those I'm touching now, in, uh, if from now until the end of the show your socks are being taken, you will make no effort to resist. Understood? Understood. Understand. And now, as I left my hands from their heads and walk around to the front of the couch once more, it's about time for the real show to begin. Wonderful. When you hear me count up to three, I will like you all wide awake. On three. Two and three. Wait, one, two and three. But come back. With a snap of my fingers, I immediately started to address the three of them while they're in the middle of browsing themselves. How's everyone here? We feeling good? Feeling comfortable? Uh, all good for now, thanks. That's great. We're going to have a lot of fun just so long as everyone behaves themselves. I told you yeah, to stop looking at me when you say that kind of stuff. Made a smirk, I turned my back on a Hiroko, did rest my audience once more. So maybe you're wondering how I'm going to convince you guys that these people behind me are really under a hypnosis? Mm hmm. Maybe you saw the hypnosis show that other guy did at the last culture fest, like I was talking about, or maybe you've seen hypnosis on TV. Hee 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 Sorry for making that laugh. And thought they were just acting for the show. A lot of reasons to be a bit... Damn, mom, what are you doing? I turn around as I notice Notsumi glaring at Atsuko who is currently giggling into the hands he's just slapped over her mouth. Is there a problem? <laughs> Don't mind me, can you carry on with your speech? Well, he can't if you're laughing through it, can he? Please be quiet. I'll take this from here, Notsumi. Turning my back to them once again, I go back to addressing the crowd. As I was saying, there's a lot of reasons to be skeptical about hypnosis, but if there's not, <laughs> God damn it, mom! Oh my god, I had a light up. It's funny. I don't care. Just be quiet. Honestly, we of all people should know it better than to laugh in this house. What on earth are you? Oh. Well, it doesn't matter anymore. Is this wait, wait? What's wrong? Hey guys, I'm trying to get this thing started. What's going on? Our eyes look to me as I turn around and pretend to look annoyed at the three of them for ruining my act with their antics. My gates fall up. On, my gates falls up on Natsumi first, who offers me a resonant shrug. I'm sorry, Kiyu. Moses just won't stop laughing. Last I checked, and laughing wasn't a crime, dear. It is if you do want an our house. Never mind that. Are you okay, Atsuku? You cried out. I'm fine. Something just started on me, that's all. Getting down towards the floor, it's hard not to notice that her right foot is conspic Oh my god. Conspicuously <laughs> bare as I turn my attention to Hiko now. What are you looking at? Are you alright? I ask as my eyes glance over the loose sock conspicuous, 
Oh my god, conspicuously poking out from under the cushion, she's choosing to stash her stolen goods. D dude, just get on with it already. Okay, so maybe now we can get this hypnosis show started. <laughs> oh my god, mom, you are so embarrassing. I can't help it. The things he's saying is just. I'm serious, mom. You're going to get in so much trouble if you don't stop it. Oh, I am? Am I? And what are you now? The laughter police? Well, it seems someone has to be around here. <laughs> Crap. Sayurken, Sayurken laugh? I have to turn around so I can see it for myself. Sayur, I can't believe you. And it's not to me shouting out, oh man, this is too perfect. I'm not getting the way of this. <laughs> Am I in trouble, officer? <laughs> Shut the hell up. I expected so much better from you. <laughs> wow, I do not even know what to, to say to that. Maybe don't say anything. <laughs> you have really bought into the hypnosis thing, haven't you? <laughs> uh, shut up, all of you. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Jesus Christ, not to me, calm down, you need to calm down, he's just, well actually it's his ex, he kind of fought of Kyo, he, he just hypnosis them just to say those things, <laughs> oh that's me, watch out, watch out, it's you who needs to, uh, what's the matter now dear, uh, not to me, it's nothing, anyway don't say it's a job, Jack, so like I was saying, this is, this whole thing is kind of something else, I'd say. Yes, if you're wondering why the the screen, just uh, the text disappeared off nowhere, yes, I'm taking another thumbnail. Sorry, okay, I can't help it, I need to make this interesting. So like I was saying, if anybody here needs confidence of the fact these three are under a hypnosis, that they may be faking well. <laughs> After like that, it's pretty hard to fake it in any contest, won't you agree? Mom, come on! And get a load of her. Have you ever seen anyone this committed to a bit? It's not a bit, we can't laugh in here, I'm serious. I can hear the uh, other chunks are not too busy. A potion prote protestations, and it really seems like everyone's having a good time in here. A good time? How much time has passed away? I could have already blown through my 20 minutes by now. And well, oh well, that's something to think about after we're done here, but right now I'm putting my hand on Otsuko's head once more. This is too much fun to stop now. Sleep, you will no longer find the word hypnosis funny. I wasn't sure I'd ever use this next suggestion when the others came up with it. Found a way out of my comfort zone. Now though, now I feel like I can do anything. Instead, I want you to imagine a cel celebrate you've always wanted to meet. He or she can be any famous person in the world, and when you open your eyes and until the end of this show, you will believe I am that celebrity. Ce Celebrity, Ce celebrity, what? I can't pronounce that word. What, Marco? What the hell? You'll open your eyes on a count of three, and I will look and it sounds like the celebrity. <laughs> I will sound so stupid. Celebrity, celebrity. At least I have an excuse because I'm not a freaking angry person. You've always wanted to meet, understood? Yes, that's great. Now on three, wake up. I then quickly pace around to the front of the couch before beginning my count. One, two, three, awake. Atsuko blinks back into life and looks up to looks at me. Hey, you alright? It's it's you. I try to look confident as she gasps in surprise, although I have no idea how I should be acting right now. Yeah, it's me. I was just passing through the neighborhood and heard there was a fan. You know who they're talking about, would you? A fan? Oh, well, this is this is so sudden. How did you find me? Okay, her reaction isn't quite what I expected. Although she definitely seems surprised to see me. However, it is I'm supposed to beat her. Oh, you know I have my ways. So is there anything you want to say to me? I. 
think you need to leave. Oh, oh, w what? I'm the celebrity. She wants to meet and she's telling me to leave. This isn't how this routine is supposed to go. What the hell is happening? It's been 18 years, Hansuke, but I still remember what you did to me. Hansuke? Hansuke? What are you talking about? Wait, 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 wait. what she's talking about? Okay, I'm kind of curious now. What, <laughs> what the hell is going on? What, what, kind of, what kind of plot is this? What's going on? Who's Hansuke? It, it doesn't matter anymore. Just get out. But... So I said get out. Damn. I have no freaking clue what's going on here. But as Atsuko rises furiously from her seat, I realize things are getting widely out of control. C can you do something? My hand seems to move on its own as it reaches up to press in Atsuko's head. S -s Sleep! Atsuko's... Fury face as she momentarily scratches back down to the, on the couch while I hear everyone freaking out around me. Yeah, that's 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 right. Allowing yourself to fall back into this state of rel relax. Speak, Marco. Speak. Relaxation. And as you relax, you'll find yourself letting go of every suggestion I made to you tonight. Every suggestion I made tonight is now completely lifted from your mind. When each and every suggestion no longer able to influence you in any way, I'd like you to wake on the count of three, no longer hypnotized and no longer subject to my suggestions. Waking up, no longer hypnotized and free of all suggestions in one, two, and three. I snap my fingers and Asuka's eyes open to look at me. He... He's... Is he gone? Yes, mom. It's all over now. She sighs, rubbing her hand against her temple. I didn't realize hypnosis could be so... so real. You're gonna be okay. I'll be fine, sis. She lowers her gaze to the floors. Natsumi puts her hand under her shoulder to comfort her. There's silence broken only a few moments later and Atsuko speaks quietly to the, to the room. I'm going to start dinner. Uh, okay, mom. We can only watch as she shakily departs from the couch and walks away from us. Uh, I guess it's safe to say the show's over, huh? D yeah. I need to talk to Q uh, for a moment. Alright, do you want us to leave? Uh, actually, could you keep an eye on Hugo for me? Eh. Not to me. <laughs> the... The... Okay, Marco, I know, I know you can do this, I know you can read, I know, I know you can do this, just believe in yourself, but why, why are you failing, why are you failing reading this, it's so easy, okay, the, <laughs> the like, the listenerly, the listenerly, I, <laughs> I'm a disappointment child. Disappointment son, pretty sure. <laughs> Puts out a pair of odd socks, tightly grasped in Hiroko's small hands. Oh, come on, they're mine, you can't prove anything. Understood. That's me leading me up to her room, and as I close the door behind me, she turns to look at me with a pained expression. Mom's really hurt. I haven't seen her look at me like that for a really long time. I let out the side that I've been keeping this since Atsuko left us. Yeah, it's undeniable that she took to my last suggestion in the worst possible way, but... But I don't understand. Why the hell would your mom react like that? I... I was careful not to be... No, we were careful. I know, I... I know. You told me all the things I could do for this show, and you saw me. I just did what, what, what we agreed. None of that stuff should have been dangerous in any way, so why? It doesn't matter, Kyo. Well, what do you mean it doesn't matter? My question hangs in the air for a moment as Natsumi holds a hand up to touch her firmly breast cheek. Nothing is going to change the fact we heard mom because we wanted to experiment. I wanted to prove we could use your pen line to hypnotize and be 
hypnotized, to have the most wonderful experience and be able to do it safely. We knew it was danger, but I still, I still wanted to believe it was possible. And because of that, I heard myself, I heard Hiko, Mom, even you, Kia, all because I wanted to pursue my selfish desires. Hey, hey Nusmi, c- come on, you're not selfish. Nusmi starts to cry in front of me, as if this evening could get any worse. Yes, I am. I want to achieve true all to myself, and I lied and used the people I love just for the sense that I didn't. Jesus. But, but I can't stop. I wonder for a moment what she means, only I notice her gaze and drawn to my right pants pocket. The pocket where I keep my pen light. We can't stop, Kiyo. Stop our experiments? No, it's obvious from not some experiences she wants more than that. She wants me to stop using the pen light, period. Just give up the crowning achievement of my entire life. Hell, the only thing, this, uh, the only thing that brought us together. Give up the pen. Give up the pen or refuse to give up the pen light on the custom. I really don't know what to choose there. I really don't. This is getting actually harder. Oh damn. Uh Well guys, I think I'm going to end this video. Yeah, well, this video was quite a while, but like yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. But um the only thing I'm gonna say, this got really, really interesting just to see how mother reacts to that actually i wasn't expecting mother to react very uh, aggressive i think i think it's because of her past and who is that guy called himsiko himsiko i don't really know his name again i'm probably going to i'm probably going to see his name if i edit this video but this really really got interesting all of the sudden i really really am having actually fun playing this game I really do hope this guy really keeps, I know, keeps go- doing what he's doing with this pen light story. It's actually entertaining, entertaining me or entertaining people who's watching this video. I, I really don't know, but I really do appreciate it. Like playing this game that he's making is really, really wonderful. I really, really appreciate it. And also, guys, I want to also to um, thank you for the latest uh, DLC mod called the Naked Glasses. Uh, we, <laughs> I mean, yeah, it was interesting, but I didn't know we'd get that much attention. It's already almost at reaching 1,000 views in just one day, especially in my gaming channel. If it was my main one, it, it would be just like average, but it, I'm actually very, very impressed. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, thank you guys for uh, watching this video. Hope you guys are going to have a nice day and stay safe.